Are Chelsea in danger this season? A lot of Thomas Tuchel out fans already, which is absolutely shocking after five games. Chelsea general news, Neymar, Zaha, De Jong, um, Josko, of course. Let's get into today's video, people. Hello, guys. Subscribe to Worldwide Chelsea. I would watch Chelsea. Worldwide Chelsea. Subscribe to Worldwide Chelsea. Thank you for your support. Yes, people, welcome to another Chelsea video, man. Keeping you guys up to date every single day, the latest Chelsea news. Chelsea lost last night 2-1 against Southampton. I'm kind of glad I didn't spend my time doing a watch-along or a review because that would have frustrated me. Shout out to all the other YouTubers that did that, of course. Um, I've got a lot of patient, uh, patience, if you know what I mean. But look, Chelsea news, let's talk about... De Jong, Fofana, everything that's going to be happening around the club as well. So if you guys can, drop a like below. Let's get at least 400 likes on this video. Subscribe if you're new here. Hit the notification, tune in every single day and comment down below your thoughts and opinions as always, people. Let me know where you're tuning in from. I appreciate you guys Let me know in the last video, of course. Please let me know and make sure you guys always like the video uh, as it helps on the channel. One click, people. But look, let's get into Chelsea news very quickly. Uh, obviously, I've done this on the live stream, but just in case if you missed it, contract sign, Chelsea will uh, unveil for final on Wednesday. So we're expecting this one to come out anytime, basically. I don't know if I can do a video later or stream later. So basically, my announcement is basically right now, as today is Wednesday. Deadline day tomorrow. I'm a bit worried, of course, uh, with what's happening remaining. Uh, Chelsea have offered a 15.4 million net salary to join uh uh, Joe, uh, Chelsea, I was saying Chelsea. Uh, Chelsea, of course, according to Gerald Romero. I just received a message, man. That's why I was just looking to the side, thinking, what is going on? I thought maybe Thomas Tuchel might be sacked if you at this rate. A lot of Chelsea fans, Chelsea YouTubers, your favorite accounts are going at Tommy T. It's only been five games, guys. We've started slow, we've got problems in the squad. Players don't want to be here, and you guys want these players to play. Then you guys are asking, why is he having these issues in the first place? Maybe some of these guys are just not good enough for Chelsea Football Club, which they are not. Obviously, Mason Mount, Kyvert, five games, zero goals. Very, very worrying. Is putting Thomas Tuchel on pressure. Broha come on, looked looked okay. A few half chances, not, not the best, of course, but it's not his fault either. So what are Chelsea going to do next? Zaha spoke in his interview after the, I think it was a 1-1 draw against Brentford. He was very disappointed with the team. Always letting last-minute uh, equalizes goals, whatever, in the last couple of weeks. Why? Why, you know, he's asking, why is this always happening? And it was very passionate from his side. It wasn't like a scripted interview. And I really, really enjoyed it as a footballer actually expressing himself, if you know what I mean. So at the end, though, key words that he said, Palace understand him, he understands them. And they've got a very, very strong relationship. I don't see the guy leaving whatsoever. I expect him to stay at Palace this season, definitely for sure. So that is what I wanted to say. And then we've got Neymar. Neymar offered to Chelsea Football Club as well. Some of your favourite accounts on Twitter are not even posting that because they're just shocked at yesterday's performance. Yesterday's performance is another thing to be talking about later on in the video, of course, man. But let's just get through this news very quickly. So the young, of course. And the big news that I spoke about in uh, the live stream, people, Obviously, Bakayoko also terminates contract is is massive for sure. Um, I was I was a bit surprised with this one. It dresses gay as well, but he's given his word to Everton. That's good. You can stay there, my friend. But this one right here, people, from Ritz and Wanna come out with some breaking news yesterday. Chelsea advanced talks to sign Josko Vardel for a fee around seventy seven million, but he will join in twenty twenty three. It looks like the relationship that we have with them for giving them team of Werner has benefited us. And got us this player for next season. Obviously, the deal's not done, but we're in advance talks to get this sorted. 77 million is a big, big deal. I see Thiago Silva maybe being replaced as his agent, and he can't play 24-7 like he is currently. He's a machine, he's a beast, of course. Thiago Silva, world class. But this guy coming in, maybe Thiago Silva could be in the in the dressing room helping these youngsters come through, like for Fana and himself as well. And Kulabali can help, of course. So that is where we are. Hacking Ziyech. Yeah, man. I, I just don't understand some of these players, man. Ziyech, Pulisic. Like, 
after the game, everyone clapping. Pulisic didn't come and, and clap. Havertz apparently didn't do it as well, but, you know, he weren't playing. It's just like, what's up with this team, man? Like, you've your loan move has been blocked. You've been told to stay. Take responsibility, man. Take responsibility for this season. Look again in January if you can bring in anyone. And just moving from there, Hakim Ziyech, you know, man was in Amsterdam the game after, uh, you know, a few hours after the Leeds game. But here we are. He's starting the game. And we can't expect results like that. What can Thomas Tuchel do? You guys are saying Thomas Tuchel needs to do this, this, that. I'm trying to think, what can he actually do? He's playing Mount and Havertz because Ziyech, even though he played yesterday in previous games, he didn't play because the guy's mindset is somewhere else. Hudson Doyle has gone out on loan. Pulisic, his dad, is pushing for a move. Pulisic wanted a move and he's disappointed. Why would you play these guys if they're not happy? Thomas Tuchel does have to take some responsibility because as a Chelsea fan, it's not good enough to see what the standards are going through right now, especially with um, Arsenal winning, Tottenham winning, all these teams winning. United are even winning, people. United are winning. What are United doing? United are dropping certain players. Does Thomas Tuchel need to drop certain players and give Billy Gormer a chance even? Now, we've got some serious injuries, people. We've got some serious, serious injuries, man. If I can find a midfield very quickly, bear with me. Angola Kante, extremely injury prone. Kovacic, uh, he can get injured any time at this moment. Jorginho gets overplayed. He's never injured. He plays for us all the time, but he can't play every single game, people. Lost his cheek, plays better on the right side, and then he got injured. Gallagher, shocking in the midfield. Carney is now here. We're going to have to try. We're going to have to try and bring him in. Billy Gilmore, some of you guys want him in. I don't know about the hype, man. I'm a bit worried about the hype, but what else can we do? We have to try these two, especially in games against Southampton, Leeds. These are the games that you can try these guys in. Obviously, Man City, United, Liverpool and all that, it's a different story. But we have to try something, guys. It's not good enough. Mason Mount doing back heels at 91st minute, hitting the other team uh, uh, opposition. I lost my mind. I put the clip up on Twitter. He got taken down. Copyright. I don't know who. Cop- who I don't know who complained about that. I put it up on my on one of my streams that I was doing uh, for transfer videos, just general videos. Taken down. Copyright people. They are coming thick and fast. I think it's the audio though. I think it's the audio that they come up for because legally I can show the content. UK law people, public law. I'm allowed. So. We're going to be seeing more content if I'm doing streams, for sure, man. But um, that is where we are, people. Aubameyang, most likely going to be the only signing for deadline day. No Zaha, no Neymar. Obviously, we've been offered Neymar. Zaha, we're looking at. All these things we're looking at, it's not going to happen, people. Deadline day is too late. It's too late. Apologize. It's too late, basically. It's, it's I'm actually worried for Chelsea fans right now, man. And a lot of people are going to be saying Thomas Tuchel out. You know, you got your Rory Jennings and all that talking about Thomas Tuchel. Is he the right man? I get it, man. The clicks are the clicks, isn't it? You got to do what you got to do. You know, you got to keep your channel alive. Some of us like me just keep it organic. I want to back Thomas Tuchel. I just don't know what he can do. People say that he's in charge of the players coming in. I'm sure he wanted certain players and we didn't get them. Players that he wants to leave haven't left because we haven't got the replacements in. So, who can we actually play in this Chelsea team, people? I don't know. Um, it's it's a, definitely a big dilemma for Thomas Tuchel. Tuchel has come out and said that he wants a dilemma to have higher competition for certain positions. He does not have that currently. So, that's why he's even more worried. So, uh, for Chelsea fans, sit back, enjoy. We've got West Ham on the weekend. I'm not looking forward to that. I'm a bit worried, actually, if I'm being honest. But here we are, people. Um, I think we're like in the bottom half now, maybe on the film or something, and they haven't even played. So uh, it's not looking good for Chelsea fans. Hopefully we bounce back. If you guys can, smash that like button, subscribe if you're new here, hit the notification, tune in daily, comment down below your thoughts and opinions, and I'll see you guys very soon, man. Like the video, man, as always. Hello, guys. Subscribe Worldwide Chelsea. I would watch Chelsea. Worldwide Chelsea.
subscribe to Worldwide Thank you for your support.